Hey guys, this is Brad from Tech Guy Web Solutions, and this video is going to be on PHP arrays. Um, this is part of my beginner PHP tutorial series. Um, you can get it at my website at um, www.techguywebsolutions.com. Um, so let's get into it. Um, what an array is is it allows you to store uh, multiple values inside one variable um, which uh, arrays play a huge part in any kind of PHP development so <clears throat> so what you would do is you can def you would define an array and you would define the variable of the array we're just gonna say my array and ignore this down here we're gonna get into that after so we're just gonna say array and what that does is it, it assigns an empty array to this variable of my array. Now we want to add a value to it. So what we would do is my array and we want to have the brackets and then equals um, we'll just say value one. Look, we need quotes value one. And you can actually store this doesn't have to be static text and this could be a variable um, as well. So now we have one we have one value inside of our array so we want to look at this in the browser so what we want to do is use the print r function and my and semicolon so now we're going to save <coughs> and reload and we'll see we have a, an array and we have a key of zero and a value of value one. Um, so let's add an, another value. So we just want to say my array brackets equals value two. Save that. Now we'll reload and we have a, a new value with a key of one and it's very important to remember that arrays always start with zero they do not start with one um, <clears throat> and we don't need to have the keys as, as numbers if we don't define a key then it's automatically goes by the number but we can define a key by going like this my array key one equals value three. Well, let's make this key three. Equals value three. So we'll save that and reload. And you'll see we now have a key of key three. So this is just, this comes in handy uh, quite a bit. And so that's, that's it. That's how you create a simple array. Um, what we're going to do now is I want to show you how to loop through the array and display each value um, and not display it like this this is just for debugging purposes um, so what we're going to do is I'm going to take all this out of here and I have an array right here just like we just created the arrays the variable is person one and it just stores um, first name last name and so on <clears throat> so what we want to do is we want to print this out to the browser neatly so we're going to make a for each loop and a for each loop is only you can only use it with arrays you can't use it with single variables so we want to say for each and then our array name person one and we want to say as key equal sign greater than sign value and then we want to have the curly braces so each time it iterates, it'll, we can use key, the key variable as the key, and the value variable as the value. So let's say echo uh, key, and I want to concatenate text on this. I want a, a colon after the key. So what we're going to do is concatenate with a period, and then single quotes, double quotes will also work. And we want to put a colon and a space. Now we want to go back to PHP, so another period, and we want value. 
and we want a line break so we're going to concatenate again and we're just going to put in some br tags and semicolon so now and save so now this should print us out a list with the key and a colon and then the value so let's reload and you'll see we have first name last name email and they, they all have their <coughs> corresponding values that we defined um, and this is extremely useful and um, one of the things you're going to need to know most about PHP development um, I'm going to have some more tutorials more advanced uh, array functions um, so check that out too uh, thanks for watching